we now have access to a £10,000 investment for each startup that meets certain criteria. Hello, I'm Harvey Shulman. I'm a senior immigration advisor with Visa Kings Global. Today, I'd like to raise an interesting topic about startup visas, something that people often forget about. In order to get a startup visa, you need to be endorsed by an endorsing body. The endorsing bodies have, over the period of the startup visa, changed their business model. And now virtually all of them require some sort of fee for training or similar support after you get your visa. And you have to commit to joining some program which will give you further training. These costs could easily reach between five and fifteen thousand pounds, maybe even more, uh, depending on which endorsement body you're using. We still use an endorsement body for some cases, which is satisfied with a small amount of equity. So you have to provide for payment of those fees, even though the visa itself says that you don't need to provide any money. Indeed, you also need to provide funding to take your idea to the stage where it could be endorsed as an innovation for the purposes of the innovator visa. What that means is you need money. Now, some people have a sufficient amount of funding to do it, but others don't. So what we've done, which I think is uh, quite unusual and unique, is that we now have made arrangements with one of our client funders that they are prepared to invest up to £10,000 in suitable startups to cover these early stage costs in return for a minimal amount of equity, which can be repurchased after a short period of time. So that's a very attractive proposition, but they won't just give the money to anybody. They want to see our recommendation that the startup is a little bit different from the, what I might call average uh, startup and has particular potential. If we are able to give that certification, then our funder will provide up to £10,000 and this could make a major difference in paying the fees of the endorsement body and enabling you to reach the innovator stage. If that might be of interest to you, then if you get in touch with us and tell us that would be of interest, then we can make a note to talk to you about it and see whether it's possible to get you that funding uh, upon getting endorsement. And of course, the fact that we could put in your business plan that you've been approved for that sort of funding will add credibility uh, to your application. I hope that's helpful.